hey guys welcome back so guys we are continuing a laravel 9 e-commerce series so now guys in this video we are going to make the footer part okay so guys i have written a small post on the footer template design using bootstrap so let me just show you so guys this link is provided in the video description and here you see the view guys that is a simple footer design for e-commerce project okay and here is the html code done and then a css code okay so now guys let's begin to integrate this in our project okay so now guys let's move to this page okay which is extended let's go to resource so let me align everything let's move to resource views inside views we have a layout and we have extended the app blade.php file okay so guys here you see it's a navbar so same way we are going to paste for the footer also okay so let's paste here and name this as footer so let's copy and go inside the layout inc front end footer okay so layouts inc inside front end we are going to create a new file with the name footer blade.php okay footer dot blade dot php perfect so guys footer is created and now you can go back to your blog and copy the code okay so let me scroll up and here you see the complete code let's go below and copy get back and paste the footer code done guys let me just explain you this simple footer this is my footer area and the column md3 so this column md3 is for the project details and then the second again the next column is for the quick links which is home about us contact us blog site maps okay you can mention the urls also here so let me just show you one example guys how we can set you can set in this format now let's copy this and paste here for the about us about us and now guys let's copy and paste for the contact us okay so contact and then guys here you begin with the blogs if you have a blog or a subdomain you can just link there so we don't have a sitemap let's comment out and next column is shop now for the collections let's go and change the url as collections and then guys for the trending products you can create a page or else redirect to home page okay and then for the new arrival products which is we have built that new arrivals copy the url guys let's paste it and then guys for the featured product let's copy here and paste and then another for the cart so here we tell cart and this is for the featured product featured product let's copy that url and paste here done guys and this is for your reaches address and then your phone number and your email id all set guys and coming to this copyright and here you need to show your project copyright and then your social media links if you have it okay so now guys let's again go back to our app blade.php this links to your footer blade.php file and now you need to see that we have a asset css custom.css file let's go there and update the css so let's move to public assets css and we go to custom.css at this top we will paste our css code let's go back to our blog and yep let me copy the complete css code copy that and paste it done guys and now let's save it and close the custom.css file let me close this footer also done and now you can get back let's refresh here you will find the footer page cool so guys we have successfully integrated the footer design for our e-commerce project so guys now let's continue next video with the new topic for this laravel 9 e-commerce series so guys thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share